Hello guys, how do you know your PC has been hacked? Well, one of the ways is opening the task manager and checking the usage statistics. In this task manager window, you can track processes running on your PC. For a normal computer the usage statistics are always in a good range, but for a computer which is being remotely accessed or listened to, the CPU and disk usage tend to be at 100% every time due to presence of malicious programs. Let's now open the command prompt. Ensure you run as the administrator to get the elevated privileges. Here we can now investigate to see if there are any established connections that pose a serious threat. We are going to use the netstat command. So firstly, let's get the characters that are always used with netstat by typing, netstat then space forward slash question mark. All the characters for displaying network protocol statistics and TCP IP for the current network will be listed. For this case, we are interested in displaying all established connections and listening ports, displaying the addresses and port numbers in numerical form and displaying the process ID associated with each connection, therefore we will select A, N, and O. Let's now type the command, netstat space dash A N O. This command will now display the information we require in a simpler and much more useful way. You will see a lot of addresses alongside with their PIDs and states. We should be concerned about the established connection states. These established connection states pose a threat to the PC because they may be part of what is allowing remote access. But first we should ensure all the open browsers are closed because the browsers increase the number of established states which may make this job more hectic, and it would be a much longer process. After closing all the instances of open browsers and other non-useful applications, you can now type the command once more on the command prompt window. This will now only display the connections and foreign addresses that are listening to your computer immediately you connect to the internet. Let's now look at the established connections which, as I had said earlier should raise an alarm because once a connection is established to your computer, one can easily remotely access your computer or listen to your PC which are just but a few of what can be done to your PC. To diagnose if an established connection is a threat, we are going to use the IP lookup locator and virus total. You will firstly need to copy the foreign address by selecting it correctly and right clicking on it so it can be copied. Now open your browser and search for IP address lookup, paste the copied foreign address to the search bar and click enter. This will show you the organization to which the IP address belongs to and their location. For instance this address is located in the United States and belongs to Amazon Technologies, this poses no serious threat. Let's now go back and copy another foreign address for an established connection so that we can research about it. Paste it in the search box once more and hit enter. It seems to be from the same Amazon company located in the United States. Well, let's now check if it poses a malicious threat to the PC by using the virus total website. You will just need to specify that you are searching for a URL, paste the copied foreign address in the search bar and hit enter. VirusTotal uses many different security vendors to give results, if the vendors have flagged the URL clean then that means it is not malicious. Let's now look for a different established connection foreign address, check its location, company provider and if it poses a malicious threat to the PC or not. This just shows you how many companies are looking at your information and have access to your data.
This URL has also been flagged clean by VirusTotal. Usually, you cannot know which foreign address is malicious and hence it is recommendable to go through all the established connections foreign addresses. By pasting the IP address to the IP address lookup, it is from Microsoft Cooperation located in France hence it also poses no serious threat. Let's copy one last established state foreign address so we can go and investigate its condition. Paste the foreign address URL into the search bar and hit enter just like earlier. This URL is from Russia and the company name is Yandex. Let's now do a further investigation on this URL as it seems suspicious because it's new to me. We will just use the virus total website by pasting the URL and clicking enter. Well as you can see, two security vendors have flagged the URL suspicious, therefore it is malicious, this means it can enable listening and remote access to the PC. But you should also keep in mind that when most of the security vendors flag something clean and only one or two vendors flag it malicious, it can be assumed that the item is clean. But to be 100% sure you can do a much more further investigation of the company and research its reviews, one way of researching is going back to the command prompt window and taking note of its PID number. Thereafter, open the task manager, navigate over to details, sort the process in a descending order for easy identification by clicking the PIDs twice, now locate the PID in the list. Then right-click on the desired entity, select Properties. Now go over to Digital Signatures, check if it has a digital signature. This cannot completely tell you that you are safe. Ensure to install antiviruses to your PC for extra added security.